Here's a quick tip, get right to it. Everybody knows how to make an insulator out of uh, PVC. You can use a cup link, a union, or a, uh, you could just cut a piece of PVC, any size. I like to use the union, Schedule 20, because it's real durable and it'll last up to two years for sure. I have some outside that are been up there longer than that but they will eventually get real but they're very affordable so you can just change them out and I've drilled a hole through it on both ends and I've put the a piece of 550 nylon cord there that uh, is going to help suspend it but instead of drilling a hole through each end like I've done with the 550 cord I've drilled two holes side by side on one face of the cylinder. So let's go see what that does. <clears throat> Here it is. You'll see that uh, I've uh, bent it over. Let me fix it real quick. over. So basically the line feeds through there like that, goes through the two holes and out. And it's very similar to a uh, the way a tent guy line works. But, uh, so that goes all the way up. It's a 30 foot mast. Down here, we get real heavy duty winds out here. And uh, God, the other day it was up to 60 something miles per hour. And this has been out here for many, many days. So it just started raining, getting wet. Uh, you can see there's the center feed, and there's three lines that go out. One ends the tower end, the center, and then you have your <clears throat> other end. This is north, this is south, and so the dipoles uh, basically I get get most uh, propagation east and west. The top one is a 80 meter. The center one is a 40 meter, and the bottom line is a 10 meter and we better go inside real quick so here it is goes through here it's basically you weave it through this first hole into the second and out and it's just very clean and this will allow you to you know haul it up into the sky and lower it back down whenever you want take it off very quickly service it tune it um, I recommend to insulate the tip get it all covered up there and once you're done tuning it there it is okay here we are on the computer and we've gone to WXTOFLY.net. This is the K7TJO wavelength calculator. This one's one of my favorite 